Assalamu alaikum, I'm Maria Khan from amana.com. Today the project that I'll be sharing with all of you and the details we will be discussing today. Its name is Taj Residentia and it is one of the top residential projects located in Rawalpindi and Islamabad. Also, it is a comparatively large project than other projects located in Rawalpindi and Islamabad and we wanted to explain this project to all of our viewers in a more detailed manner and because of that I'm going to make a number of series regarding this project where we'll be discussing about their different sectors and we will also be taking you on a tour of Taj Residential Housing Society. We will be taking you on a tour of their villas that are already built and not just that, there will be furthermore a lot of other videos coming regarding Taj Residential. So stay tuned for that. Do not forget to like this video, subscribe to this channel and hit the bell icon. I will start now from the introduction of Taj Residential first of all. So Taj Residential is a lavish housing project in the heart of Rawalpindi and after the success of their first project, the Centaur Small, that is located in Islamabad, the developer decided to transition into a luxury housing society as well. Now generally this project is designed to fulfill both investors and genuine clients needs as well. The popularity of this project is increasing day by day among local and overseas investors as well and presently Taj Residentia is in its development stages mm -hmm. and also it is one of the top most residential projects where you should invest in and we totally recommend you to do it. Now further I'll talk about the master plan of Taj Residentia and also will share with you that how many sectors are there and how it is divided. Now starting Taj Residentia's phase 1 is announced and a large area is reserved for phase 2 as well and further extensions too. It is especially offering residential plots, apartments and villas. The total covered area in Taj Residentia is 1,907 canals. The whole phase 1 is divided into several blocks and also it is comprised of particularly residential and commercial plots. Taj Residentia features Taj Villas of modern Mediterranean and eclectic category in the area of 5, 8, 10, 14 and 20 Marla plots. In addition, its commercial hub is believed to have international level and state-of-the-art commercial centers specifically. There is a lot of interest in the upcoming sector's largest project including Centaur Small 2 as well along with other surprising facilities and amenities. Royal Club Islamabad is also part of its master plan. Moving forward, I will talk about the location of Taj Residentia. So Taj Residentia is located at one of the ideal locations. It is situated parallel to CDS sector I-14 and I-15 in Islamabad and presently it has three major entrances. The first where the gate lies is on the sector I-14 link road. The second entrance is from CDS sector I-16 and also upon the completion of Ring Road Rawalpindi, it will get direct access from M2 motorway, Thali interchange to Laku Road as well. Taj residential location map is ideally positioned at 18 minutes drive from the new Islamabad International Airport. Also, it can be reached within 7 minutes drive from the Qaeda Azam Hospital as well. For now, its address lies in close proximity to the Twin Cities major attractions. And also, Taj residential does not fall in CDS sector. It is located in Rawalpindi and to further elaborate, it is next to CDS sectors I-14 and I-15, but it is not in CDS sector. Further now, I will talk about the different facilities and amenities that Taj residential is going to provide their residents. This society is planned to set a new bar, particularly in terms of development. It particularly promised to set a new name of luxury development in the town with a good blend of advanced technology and resources. So some of the offerings are as follows, gated community, uninterrupted and underground supply of electricity, sui gas and water, advanced sewerage and waste collection system, high security and surveillance, Centaur small tool, royal club, sports complex, mini golf course, botanical gardens, safari park, theme park, water park and eye park as well, Jamia mosques, shopping centers, educational institutes, international standard hospital and healthcare units as well. Further moving on towards the payment plan of Taj Residentia, their booking it starts from 20% and 30%. Now as I've mentioned at the beginning of the video that they have a lot of different sectors, a lot of different blocks. Some of their uh, blocks are possessionable, some of them are non-possessionable and they have commercial plots there as well. So the prices they vary from each other and there are different prices for different blocks and different sectors as well. To get all the details regarding different blocks, different plots, their prices, and to get the payment plan, you can always contact us at amanda.com at our given number. You can always ask us questions in the comments. And very soon, I'll be making another video where I'll be explaining about their different sectors. And also, I will share with you that how many of their sectors are developed and how many of those are still in the progress. 
Now further I would like to talk about the development status of Taj Residentia. Development is going at a really fast pace. Some of their sectors they are developed, some of them are not developed and overall the construction work is going at a really fast pace. A lot of facilities are already available over there and very soon in future it will be more developed than it is already and very soon I'll be making another video where I'll be specifically talking about the development status of Taj Residentia and will share with you that how much development work has been done there already. Now further I would like to talk about the developer specifically of this project of Taj Residentia. So the owner of the project Taj Residentia is the Sardar group of companies. It is a commercial real estate firm that has led designed and constructed the luxury living market in Pakistan. In 2013, the group's achievement is setting an unrivaled international benchmark and far higher than ever achieved in Pakistan's history. And this took place when their state-of-the-art mega project, the Centaurus, was designed, constructed and delivered. So Sardar Group of Companies is currently a proud developer and owner of this project and it is particularly well known for its remarkable construction in Islamabad. Let's talk about now the legal status of this amazing project. So, Taj Residential is a completely legal project. It falls under RDA and it has NOC from RDA. You can check all the details regarding Taj Residential on RDA's official website. Now moving towards the end of the video, I would like to talk about the booking procedure. For booking procedure, uh, it is very simple. All you need is two CNIC copies and two passport size images of the main applicant and the main nominee as well. Now coming towards the end of the video, I hope that you got the general overview of Taj Residential. Very soon, I'll be making more videos on Taj Residential where I'll explain the their different sectors i'll just uh, talk about their development status i'll talk about their prices and i'll take you on the tour of taz Dinsha as well a lot of things regarding taz Dinsha will be coming up soon so stay tuned for that do not forget to like this video subscribe to this channel hit the bell icon and until next time la hafiz amanat.com pakistan's first investment portal mashwara amanat hai